hello and welcome to the philip effect in this tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to remove this so your system can boot normally so for instance whatever we click here it doesn't lead anywhere yeah? so first you want to shut it down you hold the power button down this one you hold it down and then everything goes off okay all the light goes off now when you click on it again you need to ensure that you're clicking on the f2 this one f2 this one here you need to keep clicking on it so it goes into bios settings okay okay let's do so i click on it and i click on f2 f2 so now we get into bios settings all right so now that we're in the bios settings so now it brings us here okay you want to use these ones to go to boot okay when you get to the boot here so now we are here okay you need to go to boot this one here so in this case we have it uh, in external and I don't have an external disk so that's why it's showing that so we want to click on that so let me show you again so when you get to the external boot for instance is any boot right so you click on this one here the big one the enter and then you need to use this one here the directional keys to take it to disabled okay you see when I do so you can see it goes up or down yeah. so you want to click on disabled and after that you click on this one here the big one all right so to exit this uh, point now to to the normal to save the settings we just did you can see it says F10 so you need to look for F10 on the top side of your keyboard here and that will be this one we click on that when i click on that you see this so you want to click enter as yes okay so let's do so and then you see so if for instance that doesn't work for you like in this uh in this case it didn't you want to come back to the to the bios settings again so we want to inc we want to bring this one here want to bring it to the top so to be at the top of the priority okay so what we do is when we get to the internal hard disk or drive internal hard disk or drive you want to make it to be the first one you need to click on f5 on the top list again like we shown before click on f5 when you click on f5 it brings whatever you clicked on earlier to the top hand side so we want to click on uh, f10 again now Let's see if this works. So, upon closer inspection, I realized now we're in the boot uh, menu, for instance. If you look here, hard disk drive, they said none. So, the hard disk is probably not uh, making contacts as it's supposed to be. Okay? So, let's say. I will need to I will need to shut this down. I'm just telling you what I want to try. I will be opening this part. Okay, here's the battery, so you understand which part I'm talking about. This part here. I'll be opening it from here to see if it's actually lost contact. That would be impossible literally, but let's see what happens. So this is what is supposed to be here okay I just removed it now I opened it you can see so we can check if I put it back in that will make a difference all right okay so let's go so I, I place it more inside now all right let's see what happens
Moment of Truth. Aha. That worked. <laughs> that feels so good, I have to tell you that. So, if you have such a problem and you've tried other stuff and it doesn't work, please try to open the bag like I just did. Alright? And then you place the 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 hard disk a little bit more inside as it's supposed to be. I don't know why it's shifted, but you see that worked for us now. We just need to wait and see. So you can be sure that it worked for me. If I can do it, I think you can definitely do it as well. Just wait, just wait. Just wait, just wait, just wait. It's because it's the first time it's uh, uh, rebooting after this uh, hard disk was imputed again. That's why it took this long. Normally it doesn't. Okay. Thanks for waiting this long. Now you know what to do when yours doesn't work. Enjoy and stay safe. And please consider clicking on the subscribe button. Click on the like button as well. Thanks so much. God bless. So, um, I put this inside. So I just uh, took a little paper from this uh, stuff. I want to put it in between the space here. You don't need to do so, okay? You don't need to, but I just don't want to have trouble with uh, needing to open this all over again. So I just put a little stuff here, all right? So just to avoid it or prevent it from shaking again and this falling off. Because what happened was this one went out like this, you see? And when it doesn't have the full contact here, your computer won't boot up, all right? So that's what we did. And then before I put this back, before I put this back, all right? And then I screw it here and here. That's what I'll be doing now. Okay.